Hello friends, uh, you will be receiving this entire kit for the assembly of the product. You have, you might have received the number one two stick, number three four, number five six sticks, and this plates. And there will be a bulk packet in which there will be a screws which will be given to you for the installation, and a wire and a bulb of nine watt. Okay, so. Starting with the installation, how do you have to do the installation? I would guide you further. You just have to. Now let's start preparing this bottom table. This is our first table. We'll use one number stick with the one number plate that is given. We'll align it like this. Okay. And we'll use the hammer to. And we'll apply a slide or that the angle is fitting like this properly, so it will easily go inside. way we have to apply the pressure and put this one number stick into the one number plate hole all four sides okay once we are done with it we have to put the screws in so we have to align all these four sticks Sure it goes properly inside so it will be easy, easy to fit the screws into this one okay this way we have to put all these four sticks into the table like this now let's start with the preparation of the middle table okay for that you will need three and four number plate this is a second table and then after there will be a third table and then we are done with it so three and four number plate with it goes with the three and four number sticks okay so the take first the three number plate and align the three number stick as marked over here. Make sure you do not align this four number stick in the four number portion into three number stick as there will be a mismatch and there will be a error and the table will not look similar. Just this precaution you needs to be taken that the three number uh, plate will be growing into the three number stick only and not the part of phone number because both of them look similar but they are the mirror images okay so let's start with this so we'll put the three number portion of the stick into three number plate we'll hold it like this okay we will hold it like this okay and just put this into it put the screw into it and tighten it with the screwdriver Similarly, you have to put all the four corners of the stick into the plate, all the four corners of the plate, okay? Now we are done with the third number table and uh, we are done almost with the middle table. Now we will just take the four number plate as given like this and attach to all the four corners like this. Okay. And we are done with the middle portion of this beautiful line. Okay. Just attach the four number plate with this screws as you can see. Okay. Uh, it should not like uh, be tightened too much that there will be a cracks developed into it okay if you tighten the screws much uh, so you can now see that we have tightened it uh, only that much which is needed if you tighten it more the cracks will be developed inside it okay so unnecessarily do not so tighten karne ka koi need nahi, okay? so now we are done with the preparation of the middle table now just we are remaining with this top portion of the table we are done with the preparation of the 
bottom one and the middle one now just we are remaining with the top one so take the five number plate first okay put the five number portion of the stick into this plate like this hold it like this see the holding position is like this okay it will give you some grip to hold okay hold it like this with all four fingers and the thumb here thumb on the upper side four fingers on the bottom just will give you enough holding capacity put the screws in it in the plate number 5 you have to attach 5 number four. so now we are done with the preparation of the topmost table okay see i am tightening it as much as it needs to be hold okay to hold, to give the strength but if you tighten it much there will be some issues okay see you can see if we do not tighten it much there are no cracks but if you tighten it much there will some cracks developed into it okay So now, just we are remaining with the top portion. Okay. So let us start with this, and we are done with the preparation with the with the floor lamp. Okay. Put all the screws. Just see, you have to put this into this angle, and then attach the screw into this. The angle should be perfectly right angle. as you can see just keep in mind this okay and then you are done once you put one into the right angle all others will automatically come into the right angle like you can see over here and once you put two the rest two will come automatically okay Now we have prepared all these three tables. Now just a five minutes of work is remaining over here. Put this like this table, okay? Just put it like this. Use the smaller screws, okay? Eight smaller screws are now needed with this with this Allen key, okay? This Allen key is given to you, okay? You use this eight smaller screws which are given to you and put this like this, okay? Once you put it. Just tighten these screws. Make sure to align this properly so that you will be able to put the screw easily into it. These are the smaller screws, and the you have to just put all the four screws in the middle portion of this four round screws given over here. Okay, just fix it like this. Once we have attached all these four screws like this, okay, you into this one, okay. Now you have to just keep this upper tower, okay, and attach the remaining four screws, okay, like this. The same way we did in this one, you have to attach the remaining four screws. with the help of felling key okay You are done with the installation. Now, as you can see, this three-layer lamp is ready. But at Amazon, it's visible there are six layers. Okay, so we have this plates delivered to you. 
which is seven number, eight number, and nine number. We'll use it to get this partition in between all of them like this. You have to first fix one of the corners of the plate, number seven, and take it upwards until it's automatically uh, until it's automatically getting stuck into all the screw. Now gently you have to take it slightly upwards this is slightly tricky but it's very easy okay so do it like this take all of them upwards and you will be able to see that now all the four corners are matching and take it completely upwards until it is properly adjusted rotate this like this and check it if there is any more room for this plate to go upwards now you can see there is no room and it will not go upwards so it is stuck properly okay you can put up to 500 grams of weight into this partition okay do not try to put more weight over here else it will be coming downward and you can remove it whenever you want to it is just a partition which is temporary partition okay so if you want to put bigger things over here you can easily remove it if you want to put smaller things and have more compartment and more with more utility and put the smaller things like book a small book over here like two two three books you know 500 grams you can put it over here so that's the purpose of building the more space in it and it is a not a temp uh, not a permanent it is a temporary uh, fixture which is removable okay similarly you have to do with this plate number eight First attach one corner like this, slightly and steadily take it upwards. It will be difficult for you at beginning, but then adjust all these corners like this. Okay, try to insert these corners into the sticks and it will automatically goes up. It automatically goes up as you can see over here, right? So this is the partition number eight, which will which will be rest upwards until it does not stop going upwards now you can see even if we press more this partition does not go upwards right so this is the perfect position for this partition do not put it more upwards or more downwards try as much hard as you can to get this partition up now you can see when i'm trying my level best to put this up but it's not going up so it's the permanent position of this partition and it is removable now we are remaining with this 9 number, put it like this, same way we did with this remaining 2, so now it is not going upwards and it is the permanent position. So this is the 6 layered floor lamp structure which is ready for you to use, ok. But remember do not try to put more weight in this for uh, temporary structures you can put as much weight as you want into this and this and this one which is permanent but this is temporary so you can put 500 grams of weight over here and up to five up to 300 grams over here and a small vase or something as a display over here okay now this complete six layered structure of the flow lamp is ready and it has a six cells as you can see so this is how you assemble the flow lamp, okay?